Aloha, my name is Kahao Manzo. I'm the executive chef here at the Hilo Yacht Club. Born in Oahu, but we moved to Maui pretty young. Uh, my parents both worked in hotels in uh, Lahaina side, Kaanapali. So my dad was the FME director at the Royal Lahaina Hotel, and my mom was a front desk agent at the Sheraton Maui, both back in the early 70s. Uh, then, you know, they branched out and opened restaurants up in Iao Valley and Wailuku. They were called Pino's Restaurant, actually. We, had, we actually ran the Iao Valley Lodge in um, Iao Valley. And I was actually delivering room service when I was like six years old. So I made my first tip when I was six years old. But child labor laws being like. <laughs> but yeah, a lot, of, a lot of family on Oahu and Maui. I uh, went to high school on Maui. Just growing up in my parents' restaurant, um, you know, I started as a dishwasher, worked my way up as a prep cook and pantry cook at 12 years old. I went to culinary school in Maui at the Maui Community College and at Western Culinary Institute in Portland, Oregon. Um, so that was really a good chance for me and a couple buddies to move to Oregon, you know, explore other things for about six, seven years. Um, I ended up coming back to Maui and then had the opportunity to move to Kauai to open a new property, the Westin Princeville, and that was the executive chef and food and beverage director. So I was able to do both there, which in a lot of way translates to a, a yacht, to a club atmosphere where you have, you know, owners, they buy, they buy weeks there, so they definitely have a vested interest you know, in the performance of the hotel and, you know, the quality that we delivered. Um, from there, I, was, I had the opportunity to move to Kona, which was a great, worked at the Sheraton Kona for three years. And then um, prior to this, I was at the King Kamehameha Hotel in Kona as the food and beverage director for the past three years. You know, I just still have memories of, you know, bringing up my, my dad's, or my, yeah, my dad's grandma's house in Montreal. You know, and you go in her basement and she has like full prosciutto ham, she's, make, she's jarring peppers. And I was pretty young then, but I look back now and I was like, wow, that's pretty amazing. You know, it seemed like I always went back to cooking as kind of a, where I really find a sweet spot and are happy and, and I feel like I can really help and, you know, make better cooks. It's part of the other thing about coming to a place like this, you can help the cooks and the kitchen crew be better. But to be able to come in as just the executive chef and really make this club what it can be, what the potential is, is pretty amazing. I mean, there's so much potential here and the staff has been great, the owners and uh, members have been great as well. Um, but just looking back at the history, I didn't realize there was a yacht club here for the past, you know, pushing a hundred years. Uh, it's amazing. I mean, it definitely speaks to like the longtime families and, um, you know, Ohanas that lived on this side of the island. They all seem to have a, a you know, history here. So I think that was also an amazing uh, you know, attraction for me was that like it helps you get in and really see like the old time um, east side Hawaii, Hilo, Kaukaha, you know, you definitely get to go a little deeper than you would at other restaurants or hotels and whatnot. So we're always trying to push and offer our members, you know, something different, but we really see opportunity to give them different things that make membership that much more valuable uh, and worthwhile for them.